What up everyone, this is me once again, back here with another video. So, today, we are gonna be ranting on Q102 Philly, aka 102.1. And this is what I hate about this station, and I'm gonna do a rant about it. Alright, reason number one why I hate this station is that they keep playing the modern pop music instead of the classic pop music. Like, really, stop playing the modern pop music and stick to the classic pop music. Because the classic pop music actually had some talented singers in it. Reason number two why this station sucks is that they overplay these horrible songs. Like Heat Waves from Glass Animals. That song freaking sucks. I cannot stand that song. It's too overplayed. And and I freaking hear levitating by Dolipa multiple and multiple times. And it's so damn annoying. I cannot freaking stand that shit. Like really, I cannot fucking stand that shit. Like stop playing. Stop overplaying these stupid songs. I cannot stand it. I cannot freaking stand it when they freaking overplay these goddamn songs. Like, give me a break already. And, and I think that's all they overplay. They used to overplay Olivia Rodrigo songs and Billie Eilish songs a few years back. Even though they both suck dick. Especially Olivia Rodrigo. I cannot stand her music. I don't mind her ha as a person, but her music is just freaking garbage. And my god, their fans are toxic. You know, these modern pop fans are toxic. I cannot stand these modern pop fans. They praise these stupid pop singers as the queen of pop. Like... No way, Jose, are they the queen of fucking pop. You know... You know, Katy Perry's old songs were good. They were real pop. That's what real pop is about. And Lady Gaga's old songs were good as well. But their new songs suck. Their new songs are garbage. They always play the garbage songs. Not even one song is good from there. And I used to hear that driver's license song in this freaking station. And I hate it. And I'm not going to mock this song. Because I don't want to sound like a corny retard. So I'm not going to uh, mock this song. And yes, I cannot stand this station. I know this is a pretty odd rant, but I really cannot stand this station. This station really gets on my last nerve. Like, really. I can't stand it. It's one of the worst stations on the radio. And this is why I stopped listening to the radio now. Because today's radio sucks. And modern pop. Modern rap. Modern hip hop. Modern R&B. Um. All suck. Including the, the music industry. The music industry is garbage. I cannot stand the music industry. They're garbage. And these top. And I can also cannot stand these top. Um, their top songs of the year. Because you know what they do every single fucking year. They just put these st stupid songs at number one. That don't even deserve number one. Like, stop Putting these songs on number one. They do not des even deserve number one. Especially Lil Nas X. I used to... 
I used to like Lil Nas X because I was an idiot when I was a kid. But I am still, but I'm not a teenager now. And I'm growing out from being a kid. And I now understand that Lil Nas X sucks. And I cannot stand this Old Town Road song. And I heard that his Old Town Road song got one of the best. Was labeled one of the best songs of the year. Really? Are you freaking kidding me? That ripoff of country music got number one. You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me, man. Why the fuck is it labeled number one? Explain that to me right now. How that is labeled number one. Okay? Because it does not deserve it at all. And I'm tired of Dolipa. Dolipa. Mm, I cannot stand Dolipa. These freaking socks. I cannot stand levitating. It sounds so stupid. It sounds so stupid and repetitive. Like, really? And, and once again, like I said earlier, I am not going to mock this song. Because I don't want to sound like um, a corny retard, like I said. But... It doesn't change the fact that this song is freaking garbage. And I'm tired of these modern pop fans. And yes, I will do a rant on modern pop fans pretty soon. Because, my God. I cannot stand these modern pop fans. Because, you know, they're just toxic and... They praise Justin Bieber as the Prince of Pop. No, he is not. Justin Bieber is not the freaking Prince of Pop. You shut the fuck up. Justin Bieber isn't the Prince of Pop. He is one of the worst singers in pop. Not, he's nowhere near the best. So, shut up. You don't know, if you say that Justin Bieber is the prince of pop music, then you do not know shit about music at all. So yes, that is my rant on Q102 Philly, and I hope you enjoy um, this video. If you did, leave a like, click subscribe, comment down below, and don't forget to click the notification bell so you can get notified whenever I upload a new video. And anyways, I will see you next time.